Well, let's take that. Could be useful. Uh, wooden of this overturned chair looks cracked in several places. You know what I didn't do? I didn't grab the cudgel, did I? Go. You pat down the goblin and take an interesting crystal from its pockets. Apparently, you don't get anything else. Or oh, is that what he was attacking me with? Where's the cudgel? Now that's a foot. Disappeared. That's what happens when you kill monsters. Sometimes their weapon and armor just poofs into non existence. That always bugged me about video games. I can see he's had a sword. He hit me with it. <laughs> the slight crack runs down the shaft, surely devaluing the crystal. For whatever it's worth. Before we go through these doors, I, I vote we go through the fourth door. Uh, yeah, you know that's I've got no problem with that. Yeah, sure. Looking at all these doors makes my my brain hurt. Oh my lord! It's just yeah, it's a lot larger, isn't it? Or it feels larger. That might also be. Hey, can can we, can we burn these tapestries? <laughs> You cannot reach the banner with your torch. Damn. <laughs> they didn't look like the other ones. They looked part of the painting. You see the lit torch up the flue, trying to see what might be hidden up there. I was actually trying to light the thing. Look around the latch or something, or... Yeah. <sighs> Nothing. What is this? Stained glass. It's a mural. That's... It's an, it's an impressive window that dominates the far side of the hall. The stained glass depicts a number of robed figures, each reaching some type of conflagration in, in the heavens. Is that what a conflagration looks like? All right, last door in this grand hall. Uh, um... Your entrance into a dingy, smoke-filled guard room goes unnoticed. The goblins are preoccupied with eating, sleeping, and reclining. W well, um, there's dead rats on the table. I, we could talk to them. We just save first. Uh, <laughs> rip. <laughs> In an attempt to communicate with the goblin, you grunt incoherently. The inebriated creature waves off your remark with a rude okay. gesture. Almost at once, the goblins look up at you, surprised and specialist. It would be comical if it weren't for what happens next. They leap to their feet and then pile onto you. <laughs> you have a fleeting thought that this is what a wishbone must feel like. As two beasts each grab a limb and rip them from your socket. Oh dear. Uh. Whoops. Today, death has claimed a hero of the realm. Well. That was a hell of a thing. That, Let's set him on fire. Yeah. Let's set them on fire. I, f I feel like that is the right thing to do. Okay. Okay, nope. Uh, F9, I think? Huh. So what is the point of a quick load if I can't use it? <laughs> You're overpowered and beaten senseless. Like, I'm clicking on the quick load button and it's doing Tales dick. Of your great sacrifice shall be. Um. We need something to kill everybody at once. We need to talk to Samuel L. Jackson. <laughs> Maybe. Um, hmm. I have it on good authority that he has something that is useful whenever you absolutely, positively must kill every motherfucker in the room. Where'd I get the skull? 
Uh, I don't know. Oh, that's we, the one with the glasses. Had, that, that was the one with the glasses, yeah. Oh, expression of the squirrel leaves you a bit melancholy. Okay. Um, back away yeah. slowly? British clearly inebriated goblin sits at the table, sifting his face with a fistful of... So, there was supposed to be a goblin room in the original. This must be it. Can you quietly grab the mace, maybe? I, I suspect not, but I'll try it for you. The drunken goblin gives you a sideways glance, sufficiently cowling you into abandoning your idea. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Rawr. Um, for right now, just for right now, I'm saying this room is here just to hate us. Yeah, I can uh. believe it. Yeah, time to back off. Okay, well that just leaves in a whole other hallway filled with motherfucking doors everywhere. <sighs> yeah, I know Jesus. Uh, oh. Interesting. So we got two locked doors and two uh, unlocked doors. But also, I have a key. And... Yep. Well, what was with the sudden flash of lightning there? I think that happened because I opened the door that leads outside. Uh, uh, it doesn't. That's okay. Let's try it on the other door. Attempts to force the key. Okay, so this is the wrong key. By foul stand, I can sense the curse growing worse. Pick up, p pick it up, lad. Well, you tell me what the fuck to do about the banshee. Um, it doesn't matter which one I go through first. Oh, oh There's dear! A hallway. A goblin leaps out of the shadows, blocking your way. You both freeze, eyeing one another, each waiting for the other to make its first move. Well, here we are again. Yeah. Somehow I don't think punching him is uh, is going to work this time. <laughs> the look of surprise flints across the goblin's face as your gauntlet fist connects with the monster. With a sickening crack, the goblin goes down like a sack of potatoes. You raise your fist and try him. <laughs> So did you just aid the gauntlet for this one or something? I have I have no idea. It's just like, surely that, that wouldn't work. I don't know. Let's try it. Thud. <laughs> yeah. That cracks me up. Oh, fucking hell. Is this the end? The apparition of the banshee flashes before your eyes. Another fit of coughing racks your feverish body. This really can't be good. Ban Banshee's curse is getting worse and worse. You must find a cure. Uh, yeah. I think we found. I found the. I think we found the place to get the cure, and we just walked right past it. W which place? W what are you thinking? Um, we got. Listen, if we would have rubbed that moss against that thing, we did. Then it, it wouldn't I, open. I know. Listen, we rubbed the moss against it, and it gave us a text. Right? Why did it give us the text? It's so, not like we rubbed it on something that it wasn't supposed to go. Rub some flowers on it. Rub some... No, no. We, it we said it wasn't thing. powered. It says it wasn't powered, and we need to power it up like everything else in the castle. Oh, shit. I, didn't, I missed that. Okay, okay. Which okay. tells me that we're probably missing a skull. Or we have the skull, and we pried the glasses off of it, and now that we pried the glasses off, it'll fit. <laughs> It doesn't have a mark on the head, though. I noticed that, but still. Yeah. Huh. Is Large stones built to fall. Giving heavier. I 
don't know. Badly cracked when something huge fell on the stairs from above. Well, it's probably this. I'm sure this isn't a trap. Another damn door. Great stone of this tower landing perfectly reflects your mood. Large stone appears to have fallen from the ceiling. Swirling clouds and howling winds at the terrible strength of unnatural weather, blah, blah, blah. Throw the bolt open, unlashing the door. Uh, you force the tug multiple times before the door opens. Oh, hi! Oh, hi! The circular room appears to have been used for storage. Unfortunately, it's been ransacked, perhaps by goblins. I see a bag. You remember through the bag you find two cubes of cane. You discard the sack. What is cane? Would that be sugar cane? Small cube of compressed sugar. Yep. Oh, yeah. Otherwise known as cane. Tarp is stuck on something and simply won't come free. Okay, same thing. You see a warped reflection of yourself in the mirror. Nothing really... Nothing that you look... Nothing when you started your adventure. Hey, we have Noted. a mirror. What happens if we use this mirror and that mirror? The mirror failed to do anything in the mirror. Is that a mouse hole? It looks, it looks like that it. way. Telltale droppings at the base of this hole indicate that a mouse must be the culprit. Um, much as the crane of the Cooper has made this large keg has been smashed open. So all this has been smashed open. Wouldn't create have seen better days. Well, I'm getting are nothing gonna, from this room. Are you going to whack that mirror with a hammer? I don't think it'll work because it's one of those magic mirrors, but I'll yeah, do it. Yeah, I, I, I know. Yeah, no. With all your might, you swing the hammer. Oddly enough, the weapon just bounces off of it. It's enchanted. There's yeah. probably something... What is that new spell that we, we have? What does it do? It quells storms? You should go outside storms and storms and emotions or something. Next huh. time we're outside, we'll use it. Maybe if I use that spell on the goblins, that's a possibility. Well. I don't know. A, a fist seems to be enough for the, well, for the goblins. Well, if one at a time, sure. Fog creeps down the stairs, bleak stone walls. Uh... Attempt to open the locked door with a muffled sound of laughter is heard from beyond the room. Well, apparently the Joker is in there, so. Uh, yeah. Let's we'll move on. Ooh, what's this? Try as you might, the key won't fit. Burn it. Oh. Uh, the winding oh, stairs into Brooklyn Look at the tapestry the first, then burn it. Yeah, I think that's... Is that Duggan? Uh, intricate, colorful weaving of this tapestry highlights the epic figure of a hero readying himself for battle. Take it. The tapestry remains securely fastened to the wall. Well, burn it. What? What? I think I glitched there for a second. There we go. Yeah. Door opens with a long, eerie creak. Let's go in there. Oh, wow. Oh. Uh, we... <laughs> now that's a hell of a telescope. No kidding. Is it a telescope or a howitzer? <laughs> yeah, both. 
You can shoot at planets that you can see. This circular room houses massive telescope as well as all manner of scar stargazing paraphernalia. Isn't that a bad word or something? No. Open the book to an interesting entry. You're up, Captain. Oh, I'm thinking of paraphernalia. That's what it is. Paraphernalia? <clears throat> paraphernalia. Is that the Is that the desire for everything? Or I think kind it's of desire things? for weird stuff? That could work. Anyway, you're up, Captain. All right. You read the handwritten entry on the page. I have noted several observations over the past fortnight. The stars have moved into an unheard of alignment. The unnamed hero, the Hourglass, depicting in this time the broken sword of betrayal, the hooded figure of Thapnos, the life stealer. All these constellations are out of season and position. Yet here they are, chasing across the night skies. Unbelievable. This can only portend a time of terrible danger and upheaval. The entry is signed by Astronomer Lor L. Uh, I believe he has a shampoo. L'Oreal. What is this? Long metal rod has grooves at the end of it. It may fit into something. Take Hold that on to that. Don't poke yourself with it. There's a sextant. <laughs> Don't put your lips on it. Uh, the golden sextant typically used to sight position of celestial bodies. I guess we'll take it. I think that's another answer. If we ever find the Sphinx. I'll take this book, too. What's up with this mirror? Oh, it's a star chart affixed to the wall. You recognize some constellations. The pouring goblet of salvation and the broken sword of conquest. Can you open the star chart? Uh, it's firmly attached to the wall. Uh, I could try opening it, but I don't think it's something to open. Yeah, there's no way to open it. We can't. We can't take the star off of it this time. Yeah. Nope. Pointed at the clouded sky, secured by countless chains, this massive iron telescope must be nearly six hands high and a half. Eight. Wait. How big is a hand again? Sixty hands, not six. Oh, my bad. All right, yeah. you're right. <laughs> um, there's really nothing else here. Can you look through it? I mean, I'm seeing the 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 clouds in the background. Whoa! I imagine we can't see shit. Step yeah. close and look <laughs> through the telescope. Ah. Yeah, let's give it a go. Congratulations, you've earned the Weathermaker achievement. <laughs> Concentrating the right, image of the Goliath done. before you, you summon a wind that releases the spell of or the will to release the spell towards the heaven. Play clear you recite with the authority. The effect is immediate and the storm clouds move off, allowing you to wonder at uh, the wondering view of brilliant stars. Uh, this particular star is named after Aquedrix, the mythical god of water. This star is usually one of the first ones you see in the horizon in the winter months. It is called Thamertage, or more commonly known as the One Tree. This bright northern star represents er Erdolos, the mythical eagle that brings the morning sun each day. Oh, okay, there's a big one. This far distant sun is called Ferios. It honors the fallen one from the skies that came to carve out the plains of fire in the southern lands. This almost sounds like gobbledygook the way they say the way they read it out. Yeah, I would read books set in this universe, though. I, I definitely would. I, I mean, yeah. I could kind of see that if you could get into it. It's world building is so sprawling, though, that it just comes off as gobbledygook.
I have a blindfold on, yet I still see. <laughs> I don't. I'm not sure what the point is, was of that. I don't either. Yeah, that, that's dirt. <laughs> Partially obscuring your vision. How wonderful. Well, we got one more door, door left. I can't wait. I'm exhausted. <laughs> it's, it's locked. Of course it's locked. Thank God. <laughs> no. It doesn't work. So, we have a lot of locked doors here. Oh, hey, look. A, uh, a torch. Yeah. What are we missing? Oh, there's still more doors. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Back where I slugged that <laughs> goblin. Oh, yeah. You know, I just realized light was shining through that, uh, that stained glass window in that last room. But, um, it's night. Yeah. First side of the hallway looks to have been caved in. This door won't open. It's locked. You jam the key in the keyhole. Nope, doesn't work. Oh. All right. Well, this looks vaguely familiar. Yeah. The castle's fortification sits like an impenetrable wall against the relentless onslaught of the raging storm. Wait, I thought I cleared this storm. Try it again. Apparently, only cleared a tiny piece of it. Concentrating on the image of the graphs, you summon the will, blah, blah, blah. You're a wizard, Harry. And yeah, there we go. No more. Uh, we don't got to worry about the rain no more. Nice. Except we probably have to put in an animate uh, carbon rod. Moment, moments later, the moon emerges in full brilliance, leading the bright glow to the landscape. Like, if we need thunder and lightning to strike something, we're fucked. <laughs> Just say the spell backwards. Oh, I'll probably do it. Yeah. I like how the music changed. Uh, standing at the base, inscribed the words "Reliant Triumphant." A marble angelic statue reaches to the sky with an empty slot, with outstretched arms. Um. The claimant the statue attempted to force the bar into the slot. No luck. It simply doesn't fit. Well, we have other bars to put in there. Um, dude, we just grabbed it. Did we? The poker, you think? No, the spiky, the spiky, spiky one. Oh, shit, you're right. Yep, that was it. Well. Very little resistance. The wad slips into place. Hooray! There is no rain. Yeah, um, we're dumb. I wonder if just doing the spell backwards is something that will... Uh... Nope. Oops. Huh. <laughs> um. Well, let's see what's down the battlement. <laughs> well, okay. You know, they slip the damp, you slip on the damp, well-worn stones. Situated at the edge of the deep. Chasm, the castle's defense ends fortified to watch out. Gee, I wonder. Um, we have choices here. What do you want to do first? Cut scene or uh, see how much shit we can steal before we die? <laughs> well, first, see if you can take the head off that wizard. Hey. Good idea. Then we can grab his stuff. You decide against disturbing the remains of the long dead wizard. Besides, you doubt you could carry any more 
than its skull. Well, that's what we wanted. You rummaged through the corpse tattered clothing, but failed to discover anything useful. Take its skull. Get. Oh my god. You put the sword to the threadbare clothing before you decided. No. God damn it. Uh, we got a bow. So now we have a bow and arrow. We've got a sack. Uh, we've got a quiver. Interesting. Yeah, I was. Yeah. Use arrow in quiver. Hey, it's raining again. The crack of lightning and thunder, the storm clouds rush in, unleash a torrent of wind and rain. There we go. Ah, so it just turns it off for a few minutes. I guess we should talk to uh, Lackmere. Prepare for cutscene. Evo can unleashes your spell. A ghostly figure of Lackmere form. Oh, well, no, fuck. In arrogance and pride, we thought we could prevent Talimar from turning to darkness. Talimar. We have surely paid for these sins. Um, um, shibai, um, but this um, matters not, simple soldier. What is done is done. Time is fleet, so bend an ear to my voice. Hope lies within your breast. I say it again. Talimar the Black fears it, even as he searches for a way to rip it from you. He needs my milk. Even as he binds <laughs> the dwarves to his madness, driving them deeper into the catacombs. And he will not stop until he rips every stone from the castle's foundation. But Talimar believes that a great beast slumbers far below. Mayhap this is true, for I have uncovered much, yet know so little. Of this, however, I am certain. The Warlock Lord knows not of your heritage. This is our great advantage, our great hope. Seek the terrible skull door of Tor Drakan. What lies beyond its threshold is unknown, even to me. A great behemoth, an ancient evil, a source of power. Be wary, boy. Heed my words. Do what I cannot. Go where I cannot. Learn the secrets of what Talimar seeks. Trust in what you find. That was a hell of a thing. Uh, within the obelisk, the words trust in what you find bounce around in your head. The black mirror fades away from nothing. So how do I take this guy's skull? Because I want it. Get it? <laughs> well, it's worked so far. You punch the skeleton and bruise your knuckles. Yeah. So much for that. Alright, let's see if lightning strikes this rod. Cast this fortification soon and impenetrable oil, blah, 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 blah. So we're waiting on thunder and lightning. What's this behind it? Ancient scripts cover the part of the wall of the battlement. Try as you might, you can't understand a word. Scripts come to the battlement. Try oh okay, glasses do nothing. 